Today, I'll show you guys how to deploy Google Ad Manager tags using Ad Inserter plugin on WordPress. If you haven't added this plugin yet, click Add New and search for Ad Inserter. Once you find this, go ahead and click Install Now. You will know if it's activated. When going to the Installed Plugins page, you will see it says Deactivate here. If it says activate, then go ahead and click that. There are two ways you can access Add Inserter Settings. You can click here, or you can hover your mouse over Settings on the left-hand panel and click Add Inserter. Now, for example, you have tags to deploy from Google Ad Manager, which contains the header in the body section. On WordPress, Add Inserter, you first have to go to Settings, go to Hooks, you can create a hook name if you are to deploy separate header tags for different sections of your site. For example, you will have a different header for your home page versus your other pages. You will have to create a hook. You can give it any name you want. And the action is very important. It has to be WP underscore head. It has to be checked to make sure it's activated and click on save settings. Now, what about if you just have one universal header tag that will run across all pages of your site? If that's the case, go to Settings, and you can just deploy that straight onto the header section here. So we'll grab that code for the header tag, deploy it here, make sure this is green. So click that to have it enabled, then Save Settings. The hook that we created earlier, like I mentioned, it's only used if you have to separate the header tags for different sections. For example, you deploy a header tag here and you want this for homepage only. Then you tick that section here and you select that hook that we just created earlier. Then you grab another block, deploy another header here, and then you can select, okay, this is now for the rest of the pages except home page. And then you will still select the hook and then save settings. That is how you separate the header tags if needed. Now let's go ahead and deploy the body tag. So for example, I'm going to have this one body tag here for this ad unit. And I want this on the very top section of my page. And I want this to show up on all pages except home page. And let's say, for example, I want it to show up before the post. Then I just click on save. So when we refresh the page, we see the ad showing up right here. How about deploying a tag on the sidebar? Grab the tag, find a block here that is not yet in use, paste the code, and by the way, you can rename this if you want to, so it's easier for you to manage and identify them. And here you can again specify the type of pages or sections of the site where it's supposed to show up. And for the insertion, you can keep it disabled. Click on Manual and tick Short Code in here and click on Save. Once that's done, go to Appearance, Widgets, and drag Add Inserter depending on where in the sidebar you want it to show up. For example, I want it to show up below or right below Recent Posts. I'll drag and drop Add Inserter in there, and I'll select Block Number 2, where I deploy the tag for sidebar, and then I can tick this if I want it sticky. Otherwise, just keep it unchecked and click on Save. So when you refresh the page, here's Recent Posts, and the tag that we just deployed is right here. How about deploying a tag in the middle of the page? For example, I want a tag or unit show up right below or after three paragraphs. So deploy the body tag. Again, specify the section of the site where you want it to show up. And then we can say after paragraph, and we'll say three, so it will show up right below or after paragraph three. You can also say centered for the alignment, and then click on save. Now when we refresh the page, one, two, three, 
and the tag is right here. Now, one thing you need to remember is that when you generate your tag, if they're going to show up on the same page, use the Ad Manager Tag Generator and Tester so you can include them all at once when generating. And then the header tag will have them all defined. So then you just go ahead, take care of each of the body tags and deploy them where they're supposed to show up.